Emily deserves this award because I think she is the ultimate student athlete. I don't think there's any reason why she doesn't deserve this award. She's earned it. When I first recruited Emily, I mean, she was an incredible competitor. She just won her first NCAA title, Indoor in the Mile. She has been a part of six Penn Relays. Uh, I'm not sure how many Big East titles. A lot as well. <laughs> she knows how to win, and she'll fight, especially on a relay with her teammates. <laughs> you know, putting her in position to win, there's no way she would ever want to let them down. And she just finds a way to do it. I don't think there's anybody in the country who can touch that kid. Doesn't even realize the stuff she's done is so incredible and amazing and, and you know, one of the best there's ever been here at this school, you know, here at the Penn Relays. You know, one of the best. Great, great role model and leader to the younger kids. She's been here kind of going through this with me since I was a freshman, since I first came on campus. Through, whether it be through track, through classes, whatever it is, I've just really gotten to know her and she's as great as anyone could think and she's exceeded all the expectation, expectations that I had. I know coming in I'm like, all right, she's really good. There, she could easily be cocky or rude or why would she want to talk to me? I'm just a freshman. She's going to be a senior. She has big goals, big plans and she has never hesitated once to do something for me, help me out, whether it's talk to me after a race, good or bad. She puts in a lot of work behind the scenes, whether it be staying up late, going to teacher's office hours, getting extra help. Like She's always going to do whatever she has to do to get the grade or do what she has to do on the track and she's just become a master, I think, at balancing it all. She'll be up late studying for a test, like she makes it matter. Like some people, you know, it's like, ah, oh, just sports, just sports, but like she loves, to, like tries as hard as she can to balance the two. She's a great teammate. I mean, I don't know what to say. She's definitely supportive of everybody. She loves Villanova. She loves what it stands for. Um, she's a very happy, approachable kid to be around. She's always going to be there to help out her friends and do their nails. One of, one of the amazing stories about Emily is she's an amazing, gives amazing manicures to the point where I keep telling her you should put flyers up on campus and you could totally have a business. She does this amazing nail art and she'll do practically the entire team. She loves doing it and that's just kind of who she is. Just this friendly, bubbly, you know, nice girl. Who, you know, her, her best quality to me is she's just very unassuming. She's just always going to be there no matter what and she's just a very selfless person. She'll do whatever she has to do for other people and she I don't think she puts herself in a pedestal at all but um, she's, just, she's just a good person to have on the team whether it be for a friend or a, a teammate. I wouldn't want to race against her so I'm glad that she's on our team. I think a lot of us on the team like definitely put a lot of pressure on ourselves to do well and it like Sometimes like it becomes like I have to do this and like you forget that like you want to do this and this is fun and like she definitely like embodies like this is fun and I like doing this and I want to do this and she's definitely spreading that amongst all of us.